Health care is also the key component of this week's winter service to Oakland. Uh, he's a pediatrician who's saving lives in and out of the hospital. Kate Kelly has his story. When Dr. Tomas Magana envisions the future of medicine, these are the faces he hopes to see. These Oakland students have just completed a three-year internship that introduced them to the healthcare profession, something Dr. Magana never dreamed he'd be a part of when he was their age. Born in East L.A. to uh, some teenage parents, raised by a single mom, not many resources growing up, not very many role models. Today, Dr. Magana is a pediatric physician at Children's Hospital, where he all too often sees young patients dying from preventable causes. I'm trained to treat disease pathology, diabetes, you know, tuberculosis, but that's not necessarily what's killing our kids. For the past year, I've had five patients I've lost five patients due to violence in the community. So in 2000, Dr. Magana and his colleague, Dr. Barbara Staggers, started the Faces for the Future program to motivate inner city high school students to explore health care careers. So it was sort of a twofer for us. It was keeping our kids alive, but more importantly, inspiring them to become health professionals like we did. Two days a week for three years, students meet with the FACES staff. Each gets a case manager to help them work through life obstacles. And most importantly, students intern in the hospital. We have our kids in surgery. We have our kids in anesthesia. We have them in neonatal. Um, we have them in mental health throughout, throughout the hospital because my goal is that a young person really is able to see the full breadth of career options in healthcare. In the 11 years since the FACES program began, 215 students have participated and 100% have graduated from high school and enrolled in college. These are our future healthcare leaders. These are the kids who are going to be making a difference in our communities in a few years, mm -hmm. if not already. So I'm pretty damn proud. FACES partners with five high schools. Oakland principal Preston Thomas sees it changing lives. They've gone through FACES. They saw somebody that looked like them, that, you know, inspired them, and then carried it all the way through. So when Dr. Magana looks at the faces of this year's graduates, he not only sees the future of medicine, but is grateful for the mentors in his own life. I have very much, and in many different ways, walked the path that these young people are walking right now. It was very important that I became a means through which we could provide opportunities for kids in this community. So for helping to provide hope and a path to new careers, this week's Jefferson Award in the Bay Area goes to Dr. Tomas Magana. Kate Kelly, CBS 5. And you can support the students taking part in Faces for the Future using our link to their website. Navigate to cbssf.com, click the Connect button at the top of the page, and then down there to Jefferson Awards to find our story on Dr. Magana. Well, we've been enjoying these warm temperatures, the beginning of summer. But